Redfeather from Grepax. In this credit video, we will be showing you how to create vertical text. Open Krita, create a new canvas, and bring up the text editor. Now notice, both on my canvas and in my text editor, I have used the line break in order to create some vertical text. The line break has changed in Krita. Instead of shift and then enter, just hit enter for the line break. Once you have typed what you want to say and have your vertical text set up, adjust the font size and color, then click save and then close. Once back to the Critic Canvas, you can grab a hold of the text, moving it to where you would like. Then in the toolbox, click on Transform Layer or Selection Tool. Go to the Critic Canvas, grabbing an edge, bottom or top, and resize the text if you would like. Once this is done in Krita, it is time to further examine the text. Notice the two letter I's. They both look out of place, so let us center them. But first, we must merge the layer with the one below. Go to the Krita layers, right click on the vector layer, that holds your text. Make sure there is a paint layer below, then scroll down to merge with layer below and click. Then go to the Curta Toolbox, click on the Rectangular Selection Tool. On the Curta Canvas, place the Rectangular Selection Tool around one of the eyes or any other letter that may need adjusting. Then go back to the toolbox, clicking on the move tool, then to the canvas, moving the letter. Once this is done in Krita, go back to the toolbox, clicking once again on the rectangular tool, going to the next letter to be adjusted. Placing the rectangular selection tool around it, then going back to the toolbox, clicking on the move tool, and to the canvas adjusting the letter. Then go to the Krita title bar and click on select. Scroll down to deselect and click. I think that looks pretty good. Now for the second way to create Krita vertical text. In the toolbox, click on the brush tool. Then go to edit brush. When the edit brush window appears, go to text and click. In the Krita edit brush text window, notice the font size. And if we give it a click, we can see it is too small. So let us adjust this. Click on the folder like icon next to the font. Notice the Krita font window that appears. Adjust the size of the font to what you would like it to be and then click OK. This, as you may have noticed, drops us back to, the cam to our Critic Canvas. But we have more to do. So go back to Edit Brush. Once the Critic Edit Brush window appears, you should already be in the text area. If not, click on it. In the text area, highlight the text 
and type what you would like to say. Once this is done in Krita, go ahead and give it a click on the scratch pad if you like, just to see what it looks like. Then put a check mark in the pipe mode box. Next, we need to adjust our spacing for our Krita text. Notice the letters at the top right of the editor window. As I adjust the spacing, they become more and more legible. To be totally honest, I feel the Krita spacing size of 95 seemed to be good for me. You may find it different for you. So you can just grab the slider or click in the box or use your mouse wheel while hovering over the arrows to find your proper spacing adjustment. Once this is done in Krita, off click to return to the canvas. Go to the toolbox and click on the straight line tool. Then go to the canvas. Notice only the first letter of what you typed should be showing as your mouse pointer. Next, Go to the credit tools and options. Notice the box I just clicked on and the text that appeared. Notice it says use shift, then the plus symbol for a forced straight line. We will be utilizing this to ensure a straight line. Next, Go to the canvas where you would like to place your text. Then press shift and hold. Notice the letter disappears. Then hit the plus symbol. While holding, click the mouse, holding and dragging, stopping every so often in order to preview what letter you are on. So as not to repeat any of them and release when done. Once again, examine the Krita text. Notice ours, because it is the same statement as the first text, the same eyes need to be adjusted. So go to the Krita toolbox, clicking on the rectangular selection tool, and then to the canvas, placing the rectangle around the letter to be adjusted. And then go back to the toolbox, clicking on the Move tool, moving the letter on the canvas. Repeat this process until all letters that need to be adjusted are finished. Then go to the Credit Edit brush when the edit brush window appears, click on auto, then off click to return to the canvas. Then go back to the credit toolbox once again, clicking on the rectangular selection tool. But this time, put the rectangular selection box around your whole vertical text statement. Then Go back to the Krita toolbox, clicking on the Move tool, moving the vertical text where you would like it. Once this is done in Krita, if you need to resize the vertical text, go to the toolbox, click on the Transform Layer or Selection tool, go to the canvas, adjusting as needed. Then. Go to the title bar and click Select. Scroll down to Deselect and click. Now let us add some background color. Go to the Krita Color Picker. Choose the color you desire. Go to the Toolbox. Clicking on the Bucket Fill tool. 
and then to the canvas and click. I hope you have enjoyed this credit tutorial and found it helpful in some fashion. And if so, then why not give this video a like? And while you're at it, why not become a subscriber? And ring that bell in order to be notified your way of newly released videos. I mean, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, after all, it is free. The intro and extra of this video has been provided by none other than Alex Abayu1. Thank you in advance. I am out. <laughs>